Hello, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Parker. Welcome back to once again to another Call of Duty Mobile video today. And what we're going to be talking about is everything that we know so far about Call of Duty Mobile Zombies. If you guys are new to this channel, you probably don't know that much stuff, but I've been making videos talking about all the new maps that we can expect to go and see in terms of zombies for Call of Duty Mobile. We're going to be going over the perks in this video, the zombie bosses, weapons, and just so much stuff that we currently know about the zombies for this game. With that said if you guys are new around here be sure to go and subscribe notifications on i do daily call of duty mobile videos here so that'd be really awesome if you guys are enjoying this game to go and enjoy it with me if you guys do like this video be sure to go and give it a like as well as feel free to let me know in the comment section down below what would be the one map that you would love to go and see in call of duty zombies for me personally i would love to see origins being introduced into this mobile format feel free to go and let me know in the comment section down below and then one final thing before we get right into all this information i created a new channel called call of duty mobile clips where your guys's clips can get featured on that channel so if you guys want to go and check it out there will be a link to it down below in the description as well as in the pinned comment if you go and submit a clip you're automatically entered in to go and win 800 cod points that we give away every single week but with that said let's get right into the video today the first one on the list here is the modes so there's going to be two different types of modes that we can go and expect in call of duty mobile zombies firstly there is going to be the mission based zombies which i did make a video talking about earlier today and if you guys want to go and watch gameplay of the alpha build of call of duty mobile zombies feel free to go and just check out the video that i uploaded earlier on this morning it was actually a pretty cool video a lot of you guys really enjoyed it so there's going to be that type of zombies in which you just have to go and complete missions and at the end of each and every single one of those missions there's going to be a boss that you're going to have to go and fight in order to go and beat that mission and then for the second thing here and i know probably a lot of you guys in the comments is going to be really excited about this it is confirmed that we will be seeing round based zombies coming soon to call of duty mobile now whether or not mission based zombies and round based zombies are going to be coming out at the same exact time i don't really know for sure but it was found out for the game files for this game that we will receive both mission based zombies as well as round based zombies now for right now not much is known about the round based zombies and i know that is the mode a lot of people are really looking forward to because it is just traditional zombies that we know and love but we do have some information here about what we can go and expect with the mission based zombies so what you guys are seeing on screen right now are just some of the screen caption missions for what we can go and expect in each and every single chapter here now there are supposed to be a total of 20 mission based chapters that we can go and expect coming to this game and i don't know if it's just me but this is going to be some really exciting stuff because i can easily see them adding in with each and every single season that we go and see in this game some additional chapters like five extra chapters chapters per season with brand new zombie bosses that we've never seen before and just based off the images that you guys are seeing on screen right here granted there are zombie bosses that we know and love like the brutus the avogadro there are indeed some new bosses never seen before in zombies that are going to be introduced to this game and this is actually kind of a perfect transition because that's going to be it for all the modes that we can go and expect for zombies here on call of duty mobile and we might as well go and talk about the bosses because like i mentioned there's going to be bosses that we know and love from the call of duty zombies franchise but also we're going to be getting some new zombies here so we might as well begin talking about all the og bosses from the cod franchise firstly here we have the avogadro which we all know and love from transit transit being one of the most popular zombies maps of all time everyone loves transit guys don't worry i'm just memeing <laughs> but then secondly here we have brutus from mob of the dead brutus is one of my more personal favorite bosses out there so it's really awesome that we'll go and see him returning into the call of duty mobile zombies format here thirdly we have the denizens which are definitely going to probably be the most annoying boss like they were actually in the alpha build of zombies for call of duty mobile and a lot of people just said that the denizens were really annoying so hopefully they maybe turn down the annoyingness in terms of denizens being featured in the newer call of duty mobile zombies here and then finally we just have the traditional zombie dogs that we know and love now going into the new bosses here and this is actually really interesting so firstly we have a butcher 
who, if you guys want to go and actually see gameplay of this guy, he was featured in my video that I uploaded earlier on today. So if you want to go and check it out, he was featured on my latest video. There's going to be another boss called the Cerberus, which if I'm not mistaken, it's either going to be a three-headed zombie dog or just a huge zombie dog in general. He's just going to be one of those bosses that you would have to go and fight at the end of the round there. Thirdly, there's going to be a huge scorpion looking thing that's going to be going coming right after you and then finally we have a tree boss now don't worry it's not just like a standing tree it is like a boss that looks like a tree but he's just going to go come after you try to go and kill you and just you know fun stuff like that so that's all the bosses so far that we know that we can expect in this game but i'd have to imagine there's probably going to be some additional bosses that we'll just have to go and discover for the very first time once zombie finally releases for cod mobile here awesome so we might as well go on to the next one here which is just going to be the maps that we can go and expect for this game now we don't know whether or not these maps are going to be round based or they're going to be featured in certain missions for the game but nevertheless like with some of these maps here it does sound reassuring that yes we can go and expect these maps to be in a round based format so there's a total of five if i'm not mistaken here i'm not really looking at the list i'm just going to be going off the top of my head here but firstly we
but it would appear that Call of Duty Mobile Zombies is taking the same route like what Treyarch did in Black Ops 3 Zombies in which they could be introducing some type of gobble gum system and it's really cool because I'm going to be showing you guys some of those potentially either gobble gums or whatever they're going to be like in Call of Duty Mobile Zombies here. We don't really know what they're going to be like for sure just yet but there's going to be a very similar type of thing but in Call of Duty Mobile here. So we might as well begin here with just the traditional perk names firstly here we have quick revive which i'd have to imagine is going to be exactly like what quick revive was like on cod council there secondly we have fleet foot which really just sounds like another name for stamina thirdly we have one called hasten which sounds like that's going to go and be something like speed cola in which you can just go and quickly reload your gun Fourthly, we have Juggernaut, not Juggernog. So I'd have to imagine it's going to be very similar to Juggernog, in which you'll be able to go and take a lot more hits before you go and die. And then if I'm just through glancing through the list here, there's another one called Deadshot, which we know and love, which if you go and aim down sight, you'll be able to go and automatically go and aim on to the zombie's head, which I know is a perk that not that many people want to go and get. It's not like it's, oh yeah, I'm going to go and play this map and I have to get dead shot i'd rather prefer quick revive you know juggernaut speed cola or hasten in this case and fleet foot which is also stamina up which is a really solid one so whether or not there's going to be a perk limit to how many perks you can go and get i don't really know for sure but yes dead shot is going to be coming back and then we do have some new ones here one of them is called blood thirsty which it sounds very similar to something like zombie blood in a way now this is just a theory but maybe it could be like zombie blood in a way in which with if you have bloodthirsty maybe you can go and activate it and maybe you will be invisible for like a 20 second or 15 second period of time i don't really know if that's just kind of my guess on the whole take the next one here is called beefcake which is really interesting as well i really have no idea what beefcake could go and be like but that's going to be a new perk that we can go and expect and then finally here we have one called gecko which is really interesting as well now gecko in a way almost reminds me of like a zombie blood in a way because if i'm not mistaken can't like geckos mimic their surroundings so it's like maybe with going and getting this gecko perk that you can go and mimic a zombie and maybe the zombies will go and ignore you for a certain period of time i don't really know for sure but that's kind of just my whole thought process on it and then there's a Supposed to be two other perks that we can go and expect as well we don't really know the names but yes there are supposed to be two other perks now like I mentioned I'm assuming those are just gonna be the traditional perks that are gonna be on the map itself now what you guys are seeing on screen right now are what I would have to imagine are either going to be like a new gobble gum system for this map or whether or not these are gonna be like drops that we can go and expect but you guys are seeing the logos on screen right now and these aren't just like random artist like renditions of what we can go and expect these were actually pulled from the game files themselves and we're actually like cycling through some of them here as well and feel free to let me know in the comment section down below what you guys believe that these could be like i mentioned i really have a feeling that these are going to be some type of gobble gum system which is going to be so crazy to go and think about but uh, yeah, man, that's going to be pretty much it for everything that we know so far about zombies and Call of Duty Mobile. Like I mentioned, if you guys are new around here, be sure to go and subscribe for future Call of Duty Mobile videos. The moment zombies does drop, I'm planning on uploading just so many videos and gameplay tutorials and everything like that. As well as I probably will go live on my second channel called Call of Duty Mobile TV. If you guys want to go and watch daily Call of Duty Mobile live streams, be sure to go and check out that channel. There will be a link down below in the description as well as in the pinned comment. As well as if you do want to go and submit your own clip of Call of Duty Mobile on Call of Duty Mobile Clips, there will be the link to that channel in the description as well as in the pinned comment. But ladies and gentlemen, thank you all so very much for tuning in and watching. My name is Parker. Hopefully you guys are having a wonderful and fabulous day. I certainly am. And I guess I'll talk to you guys in the next video.